Welcome, Eagles, to Trad Cat Night, your one-stop website for all of the day's latest church apostasy and end-time news. This is your number one ranked traditional Catholic outlet specializing in the real third secret of Fatima. Trad Cat Night is featured all over the alternative media circuit and has the most listened to and most influential podcast radio show available within the Catholic world. Trad Cat Night's guest list is second to none. Search Trad Cat Night across any major social media outlet for daily information and visit tradcatnight.org, the fastest growing end times community available in the market. So what's it going to be, Eagles? Fear or faith? Flight or fright? Join me as we head deep into the darkest night. Welcome, Eagles, to another edition of Trad Cat Night Breaking News right here on the Trad Cat Night YouTube channel. Folks, today is March 18th, 2019. Very big day. The New World Order, the New Age, the false prophet and antichrist has produced their new message, which went up today. And I'll be getting to a little bit more details here on that in just a moment. But just as a reminder, uh, as we are seeing more and more censorship prevalent, we're seeing Facebook, Twitter, Instagram going down uh, temporarily. Who knows what the angle is on that? I recently got another Facebook block. Um, my YouTube is still highly censored. In any case, uh, this is one of the reasons why I've been telling everyone to get to the tradcatnight.org page now. And sign up, become a member, become accustomed to uh, getting onto the page on a daily basis because it's not going to be safe for Christians to be on social media, for prepper types, for patriot types, for quote unquote nationalists. So now's the time to make that move over to trancatnight.org as so many have already. 25 to 50 posts daily, folks, uh, exposing the apostasy in the Catholic Church, the coming one world religion, which the, the religion itself uh, will actually be de denoted as the religion of self, as the Antichrist has put it. Uh, and then also, of course, I cover the latest New World Order endgame news. Uh, in terms of the podcast, uh, tomorrow we've had some really great blockbuster talks this past week. But upcoming, uh, I do have on Dr. Bill Warner, anti-Islamist specialist, if you will. I'm um, scheduled to have Bernard Jansen on the program, the notable interviewer of Father, Father Malachi Martin, close friend of Father Malachi Martin. I'm supposed to have him, have him on tomorrow, the 20th, Mark Dankoff, 21st, Dr. Robert Sungenis, uh, 22nd, Paul Craig Roberts joins the program, the 23rd, Paul Stark from the Vatican Deception movie. Now, as I have just mentioned, the big news of the day. I took this afternoon out to really dive into uh, the latest magazine that's produced by uh, the New Age, by Sharon International, and uh, really absorbed it, uh, analyzed it. I have it already up in terms of my analysis on the website uh, in visual format as a writing. I'm going to work on that podcast next, so uh, that will be up in the next uh, two to three hours, but there's an awful lot to chew on in this latest uh, magazine from the Antichrist, the latest false prophet message. Again, so many people getting this wrong, saying Francis is the false prophet or the Antichrist. He's neither, as egregious as he is. He is an anti-pope. He is a forerunner to the biblical false prophet who might be next, although I'm sort of leaning towards there being another anti-pope before then, uh, maybe a Turkson type, maybe a Tegel, Maybe a Schoenborn. I don't know. Um, maybe even Marx from Germany. My goodness, Cardinal Marx. But in any case, if it is the biblical false prophet, once we, he, he does show up, it should be fairly obvious to any traditional Catholic, especially those who've been following my apostle. I think he'll look an awful lot like the quote-unquote divine mercy Jesus of the Vatican II cult of man. Um, and that's just my personal opinion. But in any case, the, the, the title of this latest piece by the biblical false prophet whose name is Yeshua ben Joseph. His name is Master Jesus. That's his esoteric name. Uh, it was entitled A New Beginning. And my goodness, there's a lot to chew on here. He's talking about the elder brothers who are already here, the ascended masters, the new Aquarian dispensation, what Maitreya will teach, how close they are to arriving onto the scene. 
They also have in their question and answer section, they discuss why human beings in and of themselves are divine. And I, of course, will break that down and analyze that from a proper Catholic perspective. Very, very interesting to find this in their question and answer section. They also have a signs of the times section uh, in which they are trying to portray to the masses signs of hope and signs of the times. Again, they have a counterfeit understanding of true scripture from the proper Catholic perspective. And this is why the early church fathers who were Catholic, all the early apostles were Catholic. It's amazing how many Protestants don't realize this and understand this. Uh, but how amazingly accurate they were in depicting all of these things which we are now seeing concerning the false miracles, which they call real miracles, of course. This, of course, was exposed by Our Lady of La Salette. that talked about all these false prodigies and signs uh, in the skies. It talked about the demons of the air that would work together with the Antichrist to deceive the masses. And you will see very clearly, if, if you've been following my apostle, you will see very clearly that we indeed are living in those times. They even get into the latest social justice nonsense, environmentalism, saving our planet, UN Climate Change Conference. Uh, in any case, I've already put up my analysis on the entire uh, piece, if you will, the latest magazine. I'm going to get it into podcast format. It'll probably be in the neighborhood of at least 30 minutes, if not longer, in between 30 minutes and an hour. We'll see where the Holy Ghost wants to take it. But in any case, folks, you're going to want to get over and get to tradcatnight.org and sign up today. It's highly interactive. My own articles and analysis will only be seen there. There's numerous resource pages. Of those, those of you who want to find out a little bit more information, there's a free section up top called Testimonials. You can read what others have to say as to how Tradcat Night has helped them. $10 a month, folks, uh, even in these hard economic times, it works out to be less than a half a cup of coffee, less than your local newspaper, which as far as I can see, still charges around 50 cents. So for 30 something cents, uh, this reads more like a newspaper. I'm going to be keeping you up to date on all of the latest news that's happening from around the world. You don't have to be Catholic uh, to sign up. In terms of the podcast, I am booked straight through to the end of April already. I'm normally only booked about a month, but there's been so many people wanting to get onto the podcast. I'm now booked, booked about six weeks in advance. Uh, the church is going underground. Just as the earliest apostles had said, just as the most reputable Catholic theologians had indicated that Rome would turn against the true faith, it would return to ancient paganism, the Antichrist would essentially uh, in part help to destroy uh, Rome, which will happen not only in your lifetime, it's going to happen well within this next decade, in my opinion. It's great to see so many new faces Coming to Trad Cat Night as you are emailing me after you're signing up. Good to hear from you all. Don't forget to invite your friends, family members, church members to tradcatnight.org. Yes, the Eagles are gathering. This is the largest end times community. Again, you don't have to be Catholic. Check the description box right now of this YouTube video, right? So you're watching this video, you're listening to it. Get to the actual video itself. Scroll down a little bit on YouTube. You'll see in the description box two little words. Uh, it should say show more or something like that. You click that, it opens up the whole promotional piece to Tradcat Night, that first blue link that says access to the website. Click that, uh, fill out that information. It'll take you less than three minutes probably. Stripe is the payment processor. It's faster, safer, easier than PayPal even. I've been using it for years and have not had one issue. And look forward to seeing new members to the community here at Tradcat Night. Again, do not miss my latest analysis on the latest biblical false prophet slash antichrist message they're very close to arriving onto the scene you all see uh the latest nonsense happening in the skies with pilots reporting weird phenomenons and globes and orbs happening in the skies this ties in with the fake alien invasion coming this ties in with what our lady of la salette indicated back in 1846 this is why we have to be very careful in the conciliar church of supposed miracles on any level. I simply stay away from it in prudence, no matter what certain scientists are saying. 
in any case, folks. We'll see you next time right here on triangatnight.org. Keep your wings spread as an eagle in faith and hope. Ave Maria.